Hi again, it's April Lynn, and today I thought I would, woo, you're nice up and close and it's blurry. I thought I'd bring you guys along while I make some dinner. <coughs> oh, I guess the dogs want dinner. Bella just pushed on her dog food can container. So Jacob is gonna have homemade pizza. He's not here yet, he's still working. But I'm trying to be healthy, so I'm gonna have a salad and broccoli fritters. So I'll show you the homemade pizza that's already made. I made it for yesterday. So this is the leftovers he's having. But then I'll make the salad and fritters together with you. I haven't made the broccoli fritters before, so this will be an experiment for both of us. I hope they're really good. They looked really good in the recipe. Here's Jacob's leftover pizza that he's gonna be having leftover as in a whole entire sheet of pizza i made two things of sheets of pizza and we only ate the one so he's having that i'm gonna make me a salad as i said already i'm gonna do caesar because that's my favorite at the moment or always because it's so good um, I don't have romaine, though, because I just wanted to buy a big old thing of lettuce. So I have organic spinach and spring mix. Baby spinach, baby lettuce blend, baby greens. And if you want a little tippy, tip, tippy toe, if you put some paper towel in your lettuce container, greens container, it helps soak up the excess liquid and then your greens will last a bit longer than if you didn't do it. Because they're always going soggy because just look at this. Look at, I don't know if you can see that. Look at that liquid. Can you see that? No, thank you. Um, I don't want to make any chicken for this salad because it's just me, so just me eating it, so I don't want to take the time. So I'm just going to do real bacon bits, lettuce, parmesan cheese, Caesar dressing, and crispies. I don't know why this, is, this says parmesan crisps when this is cheddar. Why does it keep not focusing? Whatever. The cheddar one is almost gone, so I'm gonna do some of this. You could totally make these yourself, but I'm too lazy. This is for quick, simple fastness. Okay, let's do that first, and then we'll make the broccoli fritters. I want a humongous salad so this is the bowl I'm gonna use you probably already know oh I forgot my other ingredient the dryer's done onion is a crucial ingredient and I forgot it in the fridge probably already know how to make it just mix it all together <laughs> This is the recipe I'm gonna be doing. I'll link it in the description. A little bit over a heaping cup of broccoli. I'm gonna put it in a bowl, I guess. 
with some water and put it in the microwave to steam because I don't have a steamer or pretty much anything. That's probably close. Pepper towel smashed into a bell. Beauty. Broccoli cooked. Check. Nice and soft. It says to soak up any moisture on a towel of paper. Soak, 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 soak. Okay, move you out of the way. One. Okay, and one teaspoon of Cajun seasoning. What is Cajun seasoning? I don't have that. I'm just gonna do my own thing. How about some garlic, paprika, and seasoning salt? Well, I'm out of paprika, so we're using cayenne. Not even close, but whatever. This is one teaspoon, so we're just gonna mix them. <laughs> you don't know, just do whatever. That's what I do. Garlic. Seasoning salt. And I'm gonna do this one. Smokehouse maple. Mmm, my favorite. Okay, let's see how much we got. This is hashtag how the pros <laughs> Dude, I think I have exactly one teaspoon. Magic! Wow, I'm so good at eyeballing. Okay, I'm supposed to toss my broccoli in this concoction. Now add two eggs and your cheese. I have not beaten my eggs yet. Dude, just enough eggs. Yahoo! Add two broccoli. Looks like a, um, what's that broccoli breakfast thing called? I don't know, I can't remember. And cheddar cheese. Okay, it says to fry on a pan, but I'm gonna try using my mini waffle maker. Put the mixture in the waffle maker. Hopefully that's not too much. They made like a sauce. I wonder, if, I don't know. If, what do you dip broccoli in? This is like a spicy sauce. Sorry if you can hear my heater. Maybe I'll try like a Chipotle aioli ranch, something or nothing. So we'll see. While this is cooking, I'm gonna add the dressing to this to marinate. This is the one I have, plain old Kraft Classic Caesar. My favorite Caesar, Caesar dressing is from Lighthouse. This is what it looks like if you ever want to try it. In the glass can thing. Okay, this is what it looks like. A broccoli. <laughs> Ooh, you know what would be good? Putting like a little bit of cheese in the waffle maker before cooking it. Get a little extra crispy. Let's try a bite see how it is in the waffle maker it looks exactly like that breakfast thing quiche that's what it's called
Mmm. It's good. Works in the mini thingy. Waffle maker. Mmm. Mm, 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 mm. I don't really think it needs any sauce. It tastes like cheesy broccoli. I like it. Ooh, ha, ooh, ha. Mm, 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 mm. Now we shall cook the rest of these. I bet this is gonna probably make like five or four. Four or five. Probably depending on how thick you make it. Let's make this one a little bit thinner. Extra crisp. I'm gonna go eat my broccoli cheese fritter. My Caesar salad. And I'll see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Oh. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye. Bye.